Now, there's no denying that the dip we saw over the last 24 to 48 hours was absolutely insane. Yes, the price of Shiba Inu coin is down. Hopefully, it bottomed out this morning around 1,700 points per coin because it is on the rise right now. It is on the rise alongside Bitcoin, which is back up above 65,000. Ethereum, a back up above 3430. Shibs at 1790, almost ready to break 1800 points per coin. And Dogecoin back up above 12 cents. We're going to talk about some of the reasons why we may have seen this decline, and of course, why it could lead to further gains now. If it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up everybody, I'm Clay, and I want to give a huge shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Cryptonomy. Now you guys, I hope you entered the giveaway, and I hope you're winning your prizes in that $100,000 Pepe pool right there, but we have got a lot to go over about Cryptonomy. Now as I said in the latest update, they are working on getting their mobile applications complete, and that is almost done, so make sure you go out, you follow their Telegram, or you follow their X account, so that you can get those updates as soon soon as possible and of course they are growing very quickly they've already amassed 13.2 thousand followers there which is awesome but I have got an incredible update for you that we need to go over now cryptonomy's bread and butter is their launch pool you can earn ridiculous gains by investing in these startup cryptocurrencies that is what I did and the ridiculous gains are flowing in now I'm gonna click on my positions and you guys know the most recent ones that I have opened up here but check this out now these are slated for a one year time slot or of course if the 5x increase has been reached now we have two completed launch pools i want to show you this one right here this one is completed and look at the total refund 51,728 usdt the income was 36,500 usdt and of course it was a 50 50 split between me and cryptonomy here and i will take this income any day of the week Excellent. That's not the only one. This one completed as well for a total refund of 42,543 USDT. So what does that mean? That means I'm going to open up another one. Why? Because one, they're working, and two, during this period of a pullback in the overall cryptocurrency market, I think as things begin to pump, as retail investors begin to jump back in, and as the prices move higher, the, the chance for gains is absolutely insane, and I want to take advantage of it. So that's exactly what I'm going to be doing. Except this time, I'm moving bronze over to silver, and of course, we're going to be going with, you know what, let's just go the minimum right there, let's... Let's do this one. Let's do this one right here. Get that all situated so that we've got enough to go and continue on with it. I have read the terms and conditions and because I'm moving up to silver status, it is going to be profit sharing of 60-40 as opposed to 50-50. And guys, look at this. Expected profit is up to a 10x and oh my gosh. I thought the 5x was good, but let's hit it with that. Create in just that easy to create another launch pad or launch pool joining cryptonomy and making ridiculous gains along the way now we are definitely going to be checking back in on this one during the next update and because the fixed staking is so good as well i do want to jump in and i want to add a little bit more to it now you guys can see uh, i'm going to scroll down and show you one that happened just a couple of weeks ago and open this up on april 8th i believe and already accrued interest 645 USDT. So I do have some, uh, I got some Solana available here. And that is exactly what we're going to be opening up this next one with. So scroll on down to Solana. We need at least, well, we got 40 in there. So let's do 40 right there. Incredible. I can't wait for this one. It is going to be another one or another 12 months for the 120% increase there. And you know what? I'm going to let this one compound. I don't want the monthly interest. So click continue. I have read the terms and conditions on that one. Guys, I am gearing up for one of the most just one of the most bullish bull markets that we have ever seen. I believe with all of the institutional money flowing in that the gains can be absolutely incredible this time around. I am gearing up and I am positioning the the same way that I hope you are as well. Make sure to check out Cryptonomy. Make sure to see all of their updates as they do have mobile apps coming very, very soon here. New partnerships on the horizon and literally the best support team that I have seen in the industry. No matter if it's 24 hours a day, no matter where you live, reach out to Cryptonomy. 
ask them for help, ask them for guidance, and they will be more than helpful to do so. Let them know that Clay Bro sent you. All right, everybody, make sure to go check out Cryptonomy, but let's talk about what's driving the gains, what's driving the losses, and what's driving the price action in the cryptocurrency space right now. SHIB is getting ready to break back up above that 1800 point per coin mark, which is a... I'm telling you, beautiful sight to see. It has been an absolute just bearish decline over the last couple of days. But let's talk about why, because everybody's pointing in different directions. A lot of it may have to do with technicals. Sure, I get it, but I think there's something more out there. If you go and you look up overall cryptocurrency news, because this was a market-wide sell-off. It was not just Shiba Inu coin specific. The best thing that I can find that would actually point to a decline is the fact that the United States SEC, or the Security and Exchange Commission's crypto enforcer, David Hirsch, has quit his position. Now, a lot of people may actually view this as positive news. And after all of the dust settles, this could be extremely bullish news. So let's go over what's happening first, why it's affecting Shiba Inu coin to the downside, and then let's talk about why it could be good news moving forward. It says, Hirsch was the chief of the crypto asset and cyber unit in the Division of Enforcement at the United States SEC. David Hirsch, the chief of crypto asset unit in the enforcement division of the USCC, or sorry, the SEC, has left his role. It says David Hirsch, a senior member of the United States Securities and Exchange Commission Crypto Oversight Unit, has left the organization. He posted on LinkedIn on Monday. Hirsch was the chief of the crypto asset and cyber unit in the division of the enforcement at the United States SEC. This past Friday was this is a quote. This past Friday was my last day with the SEC after almost nine years, Hirsch said in the post. I'm particularly proud of the historic work we've done by the crypto assets and cyber unit team I had the privilege to lead. Hirsch was the SEC's crypto enforcer against cryptocurrency exchanges and decentralized fi finance projects, or DeFi projects. He had previously acknowledged that the agency's current litigation load is heavy, and the SEC can't go after everything, but it, that it wasn't done chasing down those that it sees as violating securities laws in the same vein. Every success I was a part of was the direct result of collaboration and combined efforts towards a common goal, Hirsch added. He did not say what his next steps would be, and uh, to be honest with you, I don't know who cares. So let's talk about what is going on with the cryptocurrency prices, because this guy has been attacking the likes of Ripple's XRP. This guy has been going after Coinbase. He's been going after Kraken. He has been going after literally every United States uh, cryptocurrency exchange except for Crypto.com. This guy has been an absolute menace to the cryptocurrency scene for the last nine years, but more specifically over the last couple of years. So why is the market going down? Uncertainty. This guy has been there for nine years, and the market grew to understand what his actions were going to be. When he announced his resignation, the cryptocurrency market was left with uncertainty. What is going to be next? Shiba Inu coin didn't have a path forward. Shiba Inu coin doesn't know if the next guy to come in is going to be even harsher. But among the changing political landscape, it is going to be very interesting to see who fulfills that position. This guy is moving out. And hopefully, someone less idiotic and someone who embraces cryptocurrency steps into the role. You know, you have to understand that even though times are uncertain right now, this guy was making things even worse. He was not providing clear regulatory guidelines, but instead he was suing before issuing those guidelines. When asked why or what laws they were breaking, the SEC did not answer. This could be one of the best things that the cryptocurrency space has ever seen. This could be one of the biggest bull market catalysts that the cryptocurrency space has ever seen. This could allow Shiba Inu coin and the rest of the cryptocurrency market to hit new all-time highs. Once the dust of uncertainty settles and people begin to see who replaces Mr. Hirsch here, once the dust settles and we have regulatory guidelines in place, we have somebody working at the SEC in the enforcement division who is willing to enforce regulation as opposed to obscurity. 
cryptocurrency and Shiba Inu coin could soar beyond all-time highs. The dust will settle. The dips will, will, will bounce. The losses will resume into gains. And I am here for it. I want to know down in the comments below if you guys are here for it. And if that button right there is still, <coughs> sorry, still red, make sure to click it, subscribe to the channel, join us, become a bro. We are here every single day, and we are growing our portfolios together. Claybro883 everywhere. 6 to 12 free stocks on Weeble, KuCoin, and Binance, free Discord. And until the next time, hope to each and every one of you have an awesome day. Let's get started.